I don't even need to try this on. What was I thinking? I think I was going for like gay Easter uncle. Toss. Throw it away. So, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. My walls are bare. I'm cleaning out my apartment. This is gonna be the last few days in my old apartment. I'm so excited. Something that I was thinking about as I was taking stuff down. This is my first time closing um, a chapter by myself. I usually have roommates and um, this is the first time I'm closing a chapter by myself and also starting a new chapter by myself. And I'm so excited for it. I signed the lease today, so I got the keys. I already made a copy. You guys want to see how cute my key is? Hold on. It's a little home. How cute is that? <laughs> what I'm doing right now, because I've only packed like four boxes, I'm trying to pack everything tonight. Here in Washington, it's supposed to snow, which um, terrifies me because I drive a 2000 Toyota Camry. There's no way I can make it anywhere in the snow. I've tried it before. I've done it, but it's just terrifying and people already don't know how to drive, so I don't want to chance it. But yeah, so I'm trying to pack everything tonight so that tomorrow, if it doesn't snow, um, my homie Aaron can just, we can just like knock it all out as quick as possible. So what we're gonna do, this is gonna be, I don't know if you've ever seen Sex in the City, but the movie, there is a part, they do like a try on haul of all the stuff, all of Carrie Bradshaw's clothes, um, because she's like trying to downsize or whatever. So I'm gonna actually insert a clip of that here. This is all really happening. I can't believe your apartment sold so fast. It's a sign. Yeah, it's a sign. I priced it too low. Hey, that's the um, food. Will you buzz them in? And um, money's on the table. I'm going to get started on the closet. I should be done in about 17 years. <laughs> All right. Pink post-it take. Purple toss. Yellow storage. Oh, you're very good friends. Oh, my God. down in this place. Attention must be paid. But yeah, so um so we're gonna be doing that today. Also my cousin Anthony, hi Anthony. <laughs> my cousin Anthony is actually one of like he watches my videos, which is so cool um to have that support from my family, but I just wanted to say hi, Anthony, and I love you. He gave me a good video idea to do a tribute for the Green Power Ranger who um, had passed away a few days ago, so my next video will definitely be that. But okay, let's get the try on haul. So what I'm gonna do, I have a lot of clothes, but there's a lot of clothes that just like sit in my closet for no reason. So we're gonna try on a few and do a little uh, clothes montage, if you will. So let's cue the music and get, let's get started. <laughs> well, I'm gonna be trying on stuff that like, I don't know if I want. I guess I should take off the hat because that's not gonna match anything. I have to always wear a hat. People think I'm bald. I'm not bald, I swear. I just always am in a hat. It's just me, I don't know. So first one. This one's kind of small, but I like tight clothes. This is de a definite keep. I mean, this is staying in my wardrobe because um, maybe I'll be I'll get skinny enough to where I can button it. <laughs> but even unbuttoned, it's super cute. Love the pattern. I think this is a Ross find. It reminds me of like a Gucci Mama, but yeah. So definitely keeping this one. Just taking stuff off the walls. How much more empty? This place feels. This is a pride shirt and it says proud as f Um, I don't really wear it. I feel like this is a cool fun shirt though. Like if I ever want to feel festive and gay, you know, I got something. I think we're gonna keep it. 
Okay, let's go to stuff that's not cute that I'm like, ew, should, do I really, really need this? Oh, this one's gonna be a fun one. Kaden loves this one. <laughs> oh my god, I don't wanna accidentally have you guys see. Yeah. So this one, I've, I've gotten since Kaden's mom actually gifted it to me and I love it. This is the only whopper in my collection. Like this one's a fun one. It's so cute. It's not too short, you know, it's a good length. What do you guys say? Keep it? I feel like it's a keep. Like, what if I get invited to a luau and I just want to show out? And also, like, I can, like, adjust my wholeness so I can be like, oh, like, you know, super casual, blah, 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 or, like, bust down Tatiana. You know what I mean? So, I feel like this is a keep for sure. <laughs> Do you not know where I got this coat? Like, I'm not super in love with this to where I'm like, oh, I need to have it in my closet. I can do without says L.L. Bean. Mm, I think we're gonna toss it. So this one's a nice, but it's a lighter color, so. Hold on, let me put it on my hat. It feels weird, I feel naked. I feel naked. Okay, so. This one's nice. It's kind of tight, actually. So a black vest. See, oh. We're going to say toss, because it's too tight, and I just don't, I'm not feeling it, so I don't know. Garbage. I don't even need to try this on. What was I thinking? I think I was going for like gay Easter uncle. Toss, throw it away. This one I've had forever. I think this one looks nice on me. It's like flattering to my body. It's one of my favorites and also, I have a blue jewel in my chest and it always just makes it pop with this one. This gives me like the, think about the old McLeod building because I would wear this shirt like every day. So this and some Wranglers, you know what I mean? This one's a definite keep. This one's a really cool one I'll never part ways with. It's um, Sound Brewery. When I worked there, Sound Brewery was in Paul's though, and I was a server there before that building shut down, but um, yeah, definite keep. So this one, had it forever. There's a hole on the sleeve. Ah, there it is. It's not a hole, but it's a rip. I would utilize this for a waist kind of thing. I would wear it like this. Super cute, and it's like long sleeves where it's like good for that, and it's blue. Damn, should I keep it? See, I'm like talking myself into keeping stuff. We'll keep it because I only have one other shirt I do this with that's long sleeve, and it's super thick. Oh, we're definitely it's like shit like this gotta go. Ain't no reason for it to be in this closet. I don't think I've ever even worn these shirts. Queer core, like what is that? Oh, this one I'm keeping. Elysian, wow, this is one of my favorites. I used to wear this at Arena all the time. Elysian IPA, if you don't know, delicious IPA uh, for IPA drinkers out there. Um, yeah, so this is a definite key. I think I found that at Goodwill. It is a magical shirt. So this one I have to. Haley, if you're watching, we got this from a marathon like run we did. Um, Bloom's Day in Spokane. Um, yeah, so have to keep this. This is perfect. Oh, it's so funny. So I have this shirt. I bought it at Ross, I want to say. And it's like a crop. One day I will be able to fit it. That's the goal, is to fit this SpongeBob shirt one day. I've had it for months. I've had this for like maybe it's coming up on six months. Now I'm in the routine of where I'm like working out and eating right. So I really do see it by June. I'll be wearing that shirt. Oh my goodness, I forget. So I don't really wear white shirts. So I, because I wear makeup, I stopped, I stopped wearing makeup around my neckline um, because it would get on my shirt so much. But I got this from Ross. How cool is this? That is a keep for sure. Anthony will love this one. Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Another really cool shirt. Me and Anthony used to watch this show ritually um, growing up. So this one's a definite keep. I must have threw away that shirt already because I do not see it. I was really hoping to try it on for you guys because I found it. This shirt was very, very small. I can't remember who gave it to me, but someone gave it to me and it was way 
But the words are cool. It's this magical motherfucker. Well, yeah, there ain't no way. I can barely move in this. I think I'm gonna toss it. It's too small. Toss. This definite toss. Don't even need to talk about it. This red one I like a lot, actually. For a nice dress shirt, we're gonna keep. Oh, that one's good, girl. This one tears me up because I love Mario. Maybe I can cut it and make it into something else. I mean, it fits okay. It's good. It's the color I, is the biggest thing I don't like. It just like folds weirdly. But this is one of my favorites. I don't want to get rid of it. It's definitely cheap. Don't look at my that. I feel like everything else is a definite cheap. I'm not seeing a lot of stuff that I can really part with, which is kind of a, oh no. I spoke too soon. Glitter. Oh my god, this is one of my favorite. I haven't worn this shirt in so long. This jersey. Wow, this was one of my favorites to wear at the old building. And the fur always caused a ruckus. Should we try it on? <laughs> it's a tight squeeze, but it's like tight in all the right places. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, I was gonna toss it because I'm like, oh, I don't wear this anymore, but. You never know when you'll have like one of those days where you just want to be obnoxious, which is like, that could be any day for me. It is literally hit or miss, like, I don't know. It's like a, a flip of a coin. Like, ooh, who's been working out? She's been working out. <laughs> just kidding. Okay. This one, this one's a toughie because when I would wear it, I, it was just not flattering, but I love the color scheme. I see this color. Yo, let me give how is that look naked without my hat? Okay. Yeah, I have to keep it because the color is a vibe. My favorite color is blue. So, um, it's hard for me to part with anything that's blue because I just love it. And blue is my color. You know that song, Blue Ain't Your Color? It's definitely my color in every sense of the word. <laughs> so I didn't want to part ways with it because it's like messed up on the culture. Like, I don't know if you can tell on camera, but, like, see that? I don't, not a fan of that, but I like the shirt. Like, this one's so fun. I'm gonna keep it. The rest of the stuff, it's looking like yeses across the board. Oh, this one's gotta go. This one is super cute, and I got it from work. Like, someone had, like, lost it and never came back for it, but, um, it just fits weird. Like, the design is cool. It just fits weird, and it's a sweater, which I hate, so. I mean, I guess I could crop it, but okay. Everything else in the closet, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be keeping. But if you guys did like this video, be sure to give it a like down below. I'm so excited to close this chapter. It's been great. It's not that it's been a bad chapter. This apartment was a lot of beautiful memories made. Also, the most horrifying memory of going into diabetic ketoacidosis was here. So, it is a beautiful blessing to start a new chapter all forward with this different mindset that I have now with working out and eating clean and all this other stuff. It, it really is a beautiful blessing, but if you guys do you want to keep following along? Be sure to subscribe. And until I see you next time, stay cut, girl. Bye, guys.